Kinetic friction stops a block that is moving on level ground. The mass has velocity v equals 1.3 meters per second as it begins to slide along the ground. The coefficient of kinetic friction is mu k equals 0 0.87. How far will the mass slide before stopping? The work energy theorem is the work done by friction equals the change in total mechanical energy of the mass equals its change in kinetic energy plus its change in stored gravitational potential energy. Here is the block along the ground. The mass is at ground level where we put gravitational potential energy equal to zero. There is no change in height so delta UG equals zero. The change in kinetic energy is final minus initial but the final kinetic energy is zero because the mass stops. So delta K equals minus one half mv squared. On level ground, the normal force is N equals mg. So the frictional force, which is always mu K times the normal, equals mu K mg. The work done by friction is the dot product of the frictional force vector and the displacement vector. The frictional force points to the left. The displacement points to the right. The angle between those two vectors when they are placed tail to tail is 180 degrees. Cosine of 180 equals minus 1. And the work done by friction equals minus mu k mgd. The work energy theorem is then minus mu k mgd equals minus 1 half mv squared. Please cancel m and show that d equals 0 0.10 meters. Kinetic friction stops a block that is moving downhill. The mass has velocity v equals 1.3 meters per second as it begins to slide down the hill of angle alpha equals 27 degrees. The coefficient of kinetic friction is mu k equals 0 0.87. How far will the mass slide before stopping? The mass begins near the top of the incline and slides a distance d before stopping. We put ug equals zero along this horizontal line which marks the lowest point in the motion of the mass. The work energy theorem is work done by friction equals the change in total mechanical energy of the mass equals delta k plus delta ug. The change in kinetic energy of the mass is delta K equals Kf minus Ki, but the final kinetic energy is zero because the mass isn't moving. So delta K equals minus one half mv squared. The mass slides a distance d while dropping a vertical distance delta ug. This side of the triangle is opposite the angle alpha, so delta ug equals d sine alpha and the change in gravitational energy, delta U equals minus mgd sine alpha. The normal force is N equals mg cosine alpha, so the frictional force is Fk equals mu kn equals mu k mg cosine alpha. The displacement vector points down the hill, the frictional force vector points up the hill, and the angle between the friction vector and the displacement vector is 180 degrees. The work done by friction is the dot product of the friction vector and displacement vector equals Fk d cosine of 180 degrees. Inserting the frictional force we get minus mu k mgd cosine alpha since the cosine of 180 degrees is minus 1. Then the work energy theorem becomes minus mu k mgd cosine alpha equals minus one half mv squared minus mgd sine alpha. Please cancel m and show that d equals 0 0.27 meters.